No idea which of these saves. If I can sign for 27. 27th, that's probably where we need to look. Oh, I'm still crippled. Oh, all crippled. Wow. How do I get uncrippled? There a doctor in this town? Uh, maybe a healing omelet will do it. Let's go. <sighs> Try and eat an omelet. You see goo. going to be excruciating. I'm sure this will slow us on the overworld uh, as well. Could really use an omelet. Oh, oh my, it's you. Everyone's talking about how you risked your life for us and solved the mystery of the ghost farm. Now that know that you are always welcome here, and of course, all your meals are on the house. You may also rummage through the lost and found box and take whatever you wish as a special reward. I'd really love to have a delicious omelette. I'm very hungry. That did not heal me. Uh, so where's this awesome found box? Awesome found box somewhere I can rummage through? Is it this? Yes, it is. No, oh, it's got trash in it. I uh, will give this to Vic. Where is these? Oh, BBs. Alright. Can we barter with you? Um, not really. So, hmm, if we rest until healed, will that heal our crippleness? Or are we just permanently crippled now? How do we get uncrippled? Oh, hey Vic, I have some knives for you. Here. We can give him the BB gun. Nah, he's fine. So slow. When I find out the mystery of that chicken coop, 
Actually, do we have a... Uh, is that list as a quest in here? Modoc. I would go back to the den. After we just tracked all the way over here. What was this building? This white building. And we'll go try out this white building, and then we'll go to the general store to see if they sell like a doctor's bag. Maybe, uh, maybe the ghost people have a doctor as well. Oh, this is a church. Thank you for saving the residents of Modoc. Um, yeah, you don't. Hmm. Well. I just realized my game volume is probably too low. To hear the wonderful ambient music. Is this dead cow? There's a dead cow over here. I need to sleep. There is something weird with this slaughterhouse. Why is there just brawn and meat laying around on the floor everywhere? Okay, so best the cow is alive, but it's injured. Huh. Stim packet. Let's save. Doesn't guess this wastes a stim pack. That did not heal the cat. Okay, let's, let's investigate. Some sauce is happening here. Nothing out of the ordinary. This looks pretty out of the ordinary. I'm beat a butcher. A stairway or anything? No. If I stand in the right spot, then it says Laughter House. Fire pit. Fire is burning. Hmm. Let's go tell these people they have a sick cow. We need to hire a vet.
Howdy. Tell me a bit about your slaughter ass. You want some if you You want make something slaughtered, you bring it to me. I'll kill it for you and make it into some of the best jerky you've ever tasted. I wonder if the cow ate the pocket watch. Maybe that's why it's sick. Let's do like a, a doctoring on bass. You gotta you know, put your head on it like it's a sick triceratops. First aid. First aid skills won't help heal this poor Brahmin's broken leg. You fail to heal the Brahmin's broken leg. I can't even heal my own broken leg. Oh, I heal my crippled left leg. Crippled, but it's just you that's crippled. They'll heal the crippled right arm. What? Is that all you have? You have crippled arm? Let's just keep trying to heal his arm. Uh, we just got really lucky healing our own cripple. Win. Let's try Vic. So Vic is a crippled left arm. They're uh, like I'm be gonna be too too stressed in a moment and not be able to do this anymore. You healed the crippled left arm. I did it. I'm too tired. I'm still too tired. Um, I'm too tired. Dang it. It's, um, well, I want to wait 24 hours, but am I really too tired? Failed to heal the Brahmin leg. To heal you. I probably need a doctor's bag. That's fine. There's a pupper with the calves. 
crater. Well, I guess that's it for Mota. Call it uncrippled, even though Sulip is still crippled. I can't do anything about your arm, Sulip. But how do these ghost people? Maybe they sell something or have an actual doctor here. We didn't really talk to everyone. How do we get that there? Does the rug like a uh, you step on it and it just caves in? Yeah. That's what happened. Guys, don't walk on that. Did you deliver the message? Yes. I received well. Wait, if your services offer as a reward. Assault rifle. Okay. Yeah, I'll take it. What's that to do with that? It's a better than the rifle that um Vic already has. What is Vic currently using? Well, here, you can use this now, Vic. Here, you can have the BB gun, too. Look, he's using a hunting rifle. Oh, okay, the hunting rifle's apparently his best weapon. So, not the assault rifle. Wait, does the assault re rifle use 5mm? Okay, let's take these back. Let's investigate. Yeah, okay. It's an AK-112 5mm assault rifle. Five. So this is probably just we'll sell this. Yeah. Uh, you know we could give it to Vic anyways. I don't know. We'll see. A slag guard. Are there any other named people in here? Oh, that's me. I'm Chitsa. Probably shouldn't steal from them. Hello, Slag. I just do see you get a protector. Yeah, 
Ja, was hast du jetzt für uns? Plants. What are those plants? Hello, guard. A plant. It looks like a mutated cabbage to you. It seems to be thriving in the warm weather. Sure. Who closed this door? Guard, let's like guard, flat guard. There's a tunnel that goes up here. Guard, guard, flag. What's up here? I want a Brahmin ride. Children? Oh, okay, this is where they hide all their children. What's your name, little boy? Would you like some candy, little kid? Tell me your name, you little monster. Um... Let's be nice, but not creepy. Johnny? <gasps> Johnny?! Wait, are you that woman's- are they kidnapping children? Are they actually bad people here? My name's Chitza. Do you rat? Vic, give me- give me that uh, BB gun back. Here, you can have the stupid assault rifle. Johnny. No, don't give him candy. Don't be a creeper. Oh boy. I'll, I bet you do, babe. Let's take a look at this water pump. You can't get there. Do we need to get candy to get this kid? <laughs> he points and starts screaming, Stranger! 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 Okay, let's not. <laughs> so we don't have any way to get to this water pump. Really? I can't even tell what's blocking me. But sure. Why is there like a weird dead end over here that's just filled with screaming unsupervised children? I find this concerning. painting. What's it fuzzy? Okay, I have to take it. I can't. Yeah, Vic, uh, you're gonna have to carry some stuff for me. There's 
that BB gun back. This fuzzy painting. These people actually stole the watch. Let's look at the fuzzy painting. An image of a singer, obviously very old. The image has a felt coating that's still in good condition. Weighs 12 pounds. Okay, I don't know what we could possibly do with this, but... Basulik, you will carry it, my friend. What you be needing? Actually, you need more ammo, don't you? Here. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, maybe we need to loot these shelves over here as well. They grow mole rats. Save again. Some care that I'm stealing. Okay, I don't actually want to steal anything from there. Shovels. Lots of shovels. Yeah, they're all about the troubles here. Hey, can I ask you why you have a kid named Johnny? Let's go talk to Johnny's mom. And yeah, I'm sorry, Sulek. We'll try and heal you again when we get back to town. And well. In here, right? Is that not the same Johnny? Ice chest. Sorry for looting you guys. Have uh, have one of these as well. Uh, that's it. out more about this woman and her child. The 
use this armor actually. What does this sell for? 300? We could sell the fuzzy painting. I think that'd be acceptable. Ooh, that's a lot of money though still. How much are all of these worth again? Oh. It's okay, we could armor Vic for pretty cheap. Five bucks, baby. And we'll just remember the fuzzy paintings here. Yeah, I think this makes sense. Hey, Vic. Here, here's some armor, my man. You have a healing powder as well. Mean? Just one. Go down the well. Well, connect to anything. somehow connect to their tunnel. Did oh. Johnny fall down this well and somehow get to their tunnels? Like, no one has told me anything about Johnny, though, so maybe it's just a red herring. Let's ask the bed and breakfast lady anything that we can. can't ask her questions anymore. Well. Look at these tabs. child in here. Hello, who are you? A scruffy little lad. Oh, okay, that's where the stable boy sleeps. Okay, so look, come over here so you can stop your belly ache. Failed to heal you. Well, we're just gonna keep trying till we can't. Even to have his smashing arm. I healed it! 
Okay, now he'll stop complaining. Uh, let's try this cow again. Cow, I would like to heal you. If I can heal Sulik, I can heal a cow. Come on. You can do it. <laughs> Repair. Now. Science! The reason the Brahmin have... Okay, the Brahmin has two heads because of radiation exposure. Awesome. So I know what a Brahmin and a cow are interesting. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to heal its leg. I need to come back with a doctor's bag or something. Well, we're all uncrippled. Um, uncrippled. And I feel like there's still, like, a mystery here with Johnny, but we'll ignore it for now. Let's head to Vault City. Um, Moonshiners? Okay. Some friendly people. Space vehicle of some kind. It looks like it crashed here recently. Recently? Well, I guess his body's still fresh. Dead red shirt. A phaser? What? A phaser? A hypo spray? Yeah, give me these. Oh, this is amazing. Yeah, we found, uh, like a Star Trek Easter egg. That's cool. I was hoping it would be, I mean, more than just a silly Easter egg, but... Sure. What can we do with a phaser? What type of batteries does it take? Small energy cell. If it wasn't damaged, the gun could be the ultimate weapon against any enemy. Okay. Interesting. Tell Vic to use that armor. Let's go. Nope, we did. Give me your old armor. We should probably hold on to the phaser. 
What you be needing? Let's go. What you be need? Uh, so that is very cool. It's a Federation shuttle. So it's still some high tech vault stuff. Okay, lady? You look like you've been crying. It's my husband Joshua. He got in some trouble in the bar. He accidentally struck a citizen and was arrested. He didn't mean to, but he'd been drinking and... Uh, where is he now? Inside the city, in the servant allocation center. They said he could work off his prison sentence as a servant. But that'll take years. Yeah, I mean, what can what can be done about it? I don't have much money left, and we'll have to leave soon if we can't afford to pay the guards for protection. They said if we want to stay with Joshua, then they could make us servants too. Ooh. Yeah, I'll talk to someone at the allocation center. Man charges Barkus, Officer Barkus. I couldn't even get inside the city to see him. I don't even know if Joshua's all right. I. Yeah, don't worry. Let's see what we can do. So whatever we do, don't get rowdy in the bar. Dusty looking traveler. Oh, you have like a day pass to get in. Well, now I ain't seen you around before, stranger. Name's Cassidy. I run this place. What can I do you for? Uh, what can I do for you? 
Um... Yeah, what's interesting going on? Interesting, huh, friend? Vault City ain't an interesting place. Unless the guards get bored, then you better take cover. Why are you asking? You looking for something in this sinkhole? I'm looking for a vault. Vault? The only vault I know of is the one inside the city. Big friggin' hole. You can't miss it. Uh, thanks. What do you have to drink? Yeah, no. No thanks. Later. Courtyard, wow. You take a big gulp of well water. It's unusually warm. What does this say? Clinic. Hey, do you still have doctor pack? Oh, what is this place? The old doctor in the back. Old doctor. Oh, auto doctor. A loner. Yeah, I'll go take a look at your ornery machine. Well, I guess I should change this to... We've arrived at Valsi. We're not still trying to get here. Okay. Fair dash auto dog. See an ancient looking auto dog. It's clicking and whirring unhealthily. A great deal of heat emitting from it. I can't repair it. Science it. Looks several decades past its scheduled maintenance. The damage wasn't as bad as it seemed. Some interior cables needed to be replaced and the diagnostic board cleaned. No problem. Again, 100 XP. Awesome. I fixed it. Okay, what can we, can we do anything with this? Hey, I fixed your machine. Wait, he, I can't even tell him that I fixed it? Oh, that's annoying. Can I use this now? Hmm. Alright. We repaired it for nothing. Don't even get a kudos. Happy Harry. Looking to trade. Whoa, okay, frag grenade. This so it's, we're selling this for sure. Hmm. I'd actually like to buy, I think, some more of this full metal jacket. We could just buy it outright. Oh, not plus 99. Hey, uh, Vic. Have some more ammunition. 
mission for you. Yeah, I think we should just sell this assault rifle. Uh, we'll keep it a little bit longer, just just in case, but. Yeah, I mean, he claims the hunting rifle's his best weapon, so... Um... Fuck that your gear. Almost any rifle. So, I don't know. He says that the hunting rifle's better, so... Smell something, box? No, I don't. The cows, maybe? Let's save again. Gotta go find Wallace. Another wall. Customs. Hello, is there anyone in here? No. What is this room? Is a room with just a chair? Okay, no, it does have a table. Look at this. Okay, where's Wallace? Proper authorization. You want to get involved, City, you need to speak to Wallace, head of customs. Where can I find him? Is he? I didn't see him in there. Where is he? He's not in here. I need to wait for like a specific time. Let's wait till morning. Okay, let's talk. <laughs> well, what the heck? Where's Wallace? Wallace ain't here, buddy. Oh, are you Wallace? No. I rest in this area. Okay, that's what rest till morning. Maybe Wallace was asleep somewhere. Aha! Wallace's assistant, Skeev. Hey, Skeev. Look, outsider, if you've got customs business, Wallace is in the back there, okay? He'll set you up with the forms you need. What is this place? This is the customs office, like the sign outside says. You haven't got customs business, what are you doing here? I don't want to get inside the city. Well, you can see my boss, Wallace, and try to get permission to get inside. You'd be wasting your time. He never lets anybody in. Of course, there's other ways. Uh, please expand upon that. If you've got the cash, then I'll go into detail. Otherwise... Got money. For 200 bucks, I can make you a full-fledged citizen. You'll have free passage through the gate, no hassles. I can print out the papers, register your serial number, and have you on your way in five minutes. Huh. I mean, yeah, we can afford that. What does it take to become a real citizen? Well, if you're not born a citizen, then you have to take a test to become a citizen. Number of outsiders that have taken the test and become citizens? Zero. Your chance? Less than zero. What is this test? Gregory, the proconsul, gives a test to any outsiders who want to become citizens. It measures their intelligence and perception, and you have to be damned lucky to pass it, too. 
which most citizens would have trouble with. What makes it so hard? Since most outsiders can't read, do trigonometry, or spell Australopithecus, you figure it out. You figure it out. It's just an excuse to keep outsiders from becoming citizens. I see. We want to take that test, I think. Hello. Uh, who are you? I'm the customs officer for the vault. I accommodate those who wish to conduct business. Uh, what do you mean? I'd like to enter the city. If you want to enter Vault City, you'll need a good reason. Only a Vault citizen has the right to come and go as they please. All other citizens, or all other people, must procure a day pass. What's a day pass? So you need to deal directly with the merchants or the first citizen given a day pass. I need to speak to the first citizen. Oh, okay. Um. Bert, that's why it's vital I speak to her. I'll be sure to throw in a good word about how efficiently the customs office is being run. But if you can't help me. What is it? Your first citizen's ears alone. Can we do this? I wouldn't trouble you if it wasn't a matter of extreme urgency, officer. I'll be sure to mention how helpful you were. Nice! And we got day pass. Here you go. What for? Oh. Am I carrying anything like that? Is it my alcohol? Do I have alcohol on me? Oh, rock gut. Is that it? Is this booze? What is this? Very strong liquor or cleaning fluid. I just leave it here on the floor. Will it be okay? Figured I might need to like clean something with it. Here you go. Sure. Wait, it was just the rock that. Okay, so we have the tap house. Work, you stupid piece of junk. Maintenance center. Amenities. Amenities. Servant allocation center. This. And you compile those ammunition lists. Correction center, okay. Oh, what is this? Is that the vault entrance? What is that? Sure. Let's go talk in the tap ass first. Lydia, can you carry my burdens? I'm looking for some information. What can you tell me about the slavery in Vault City? <laughs> Better not call it slavery around here, or you're going to get yourself in a whole mess of trouble. They're called servants, 
not slaves. Just a word of advice. A uh, point take. Uh, ooh. Uh, that's weird. I didn't even alt tab. Why? Why did this happen? That's fine. Who's in charge? First citizen Lynette. In the council building. What do you have on tap? Synthetic beers and liquor. Vodka H. Tequila derivatives W and W2. Water. Brahmin milk. Brahmin milk. That's just synthahol. Do you have any real alcohol? Perhaps. I had a bottle of Mad Dog 3030. Better stuff. I couldn't feel my tongue afterwards, but it was refreshingly different. Interesting. Interesting. So, if I can smuggle some real alcohol in here somehow... Okay. Ten bottles of premium alcohol. Ten bottles of beer. Okay. Sure. So... We'll try. Is this is the house. It's not labeled. This is frightfully jumps. No number on the back. Healthy looking woman. Are you a servant? Actually, we didn't talk to everyone else's name. Yeah, let's go into these amenities, build this amenities A. What is this place? Sub amenities office A. We handle tools and repair equipment. Okay, that's not super interesting. About amenities building B, what do you have in stock? Hello. Aha. Uh -huh. Um this first aid kill, let me treat that cow. think about this. I'll come back and see. Try the store in the courtyard outside the city. They carry everything you outsiders need. Sure. Uh, what are you doing with me inside? Val. What are you, uh, dad? I'm definitely not your dad, kid. Oh. Is Vic? Okay. 
Awesome. Okay. <laughs> well, this was interesting. Really? You don't believe him? It is the truth. No, I drank water from the well. I might need to go talk to the doctor. What do you repair? Cool. Missing wrench. You know, why can't you just get more tools? I could try helping. I could find someone and bring them back to you. Wrench and a pair of pliers. Sure. I feel like we had one or more of those things in Soul Flame, but, but maybe not. This uh, just had tools, right? Cool, generic tool. Oh god, why is that so expensive? Save game for sure. Let's 
This is so stupid. Oh, okay. Where do you keep your... What is this place? Manny's office, got your typical stuff, basic, basic living necessities, some books, how-to manuals, some tools. Uh, do you have a, a gack? Well, do you have one? Oh, okay. Um, hmm. Yeah, are there any other vaults you know of? Okay, citizens are allowed in the vault, so I'd, I probably do need to become a citizen. Wait, what do you have in stock? Oh, what do you sell, my man? Nothing? Okay. Let's toss. tribe inside the city of service servants. I mean, they just brought your tribe in? Interesting. What is this building? I'm looking for Joshua. transferred hmm. like to negotiate his oh but he has a contagious disease where of Chitza's syndrome it doesn't show up on most medical scans and symptoms can lie dormant for weeks Wait, really? What? Okay, problem solved. Uh, I didn't realize that'd be so easy. Dude, what a, what a moron. Let's save. Radiated. You heard the word today? Bird is the word? The word is selfishness. Mix in a slew of arrogance and what you have, Vault City, in all its self-righteous slave trading glory. Hey, why do you live here? Testify. Amen. All right. Yeah, I'm a kindred soul, baby. Briefcase with information vital to our cause. We deliver it to New Reno for it. Oh, 
Yeah, definitely. John Bishop in New Reno. Yeah, I can do that. If we can make it to New Reno without dying on the way. Mako in the correction center. This is the vault, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What is this? Information center. Yeah, I could use some information. Just be saving nonstop. Hmm. Okay, so this is like a fancy restaurant, an outdoor eating area, it looks like. Central Council. Citizens. Nothing like a satisfying urinating experience. Oh, I didn't get a screenshot of it in time. Maybe these people look notable. Suited bartender man. What's on tap? Mineral water, distilled water, sparkling water, and several synthetic alcohols. Um, I love water. There was some of that sparkling water, baby. I have mistaken for some reason. Let me just one second. So I guess we need to go talk to the council first first lady or whatever. Okay, that's probably the first citizen right there, then. Let's talk to other people first. Who are you? 
Pizza. Um, looking for a Garden of Eden creation kit. What is it? It's about thirteen. What was in the shipment meant for Vault 13? Water chest. Oh, those bastards. Oh yeah, citizenship test. Yeah, what are the benefits of being a citizen? A comprehensive exam divided into several parts, advanced mathematics, spatial relations, deductive reasoning, language comprehension, and a thorough physical examination. Yeah, I'll take it. Several hours long? You bet. What? I don't have the intelligence necessary. M7, it's very good. Please. Wow. Can I just go like through all of their bookshelves? Nothing. Hello. Good day to you, stranger. I am First Citizen Lynette. May I inquire as to your business here? Yes. Are you the overseer of this vault? Overseer? Why, no. There has been no overseer in a hundred years. How do you know of the vault overseers? Descendant of the first vault dweller. Descendant of the vault dweller? What do you mean? The great grandchild of the first vault dweller. The first vault dweller? What? You must mean another vault. We have never been in contact with another vault. Where is it located? Find it. Oh, now I understand. But what proof do you have that your ancestor was from a vault? Vault jumpsuit. Very well, let me see. These... These are authentic. Unbelievable. You are a survivor from another vault. Welcome to our city. You must have suffered much in the outside world. Find the vault my people came. Hmm. Perhaps some mention of your vault is in our computer archives. I'd be grateful if you let me check. We could check the vault computers. They would probably have the information you seek. But only citizens are allowed to access the archives. You may speak with Proconsul yeah. Gregory. He has authority to administer the citizenship test. He can be found in the meeting room down the corridor. Thank you for your time. Or... There is another way to become a citizen. What would that be? Rather than taking the test, you could prove your commitment to the vaults in a more substantial way. As an outsider, you are in a unique position to resolve a difficult situation for us.
What kind of situation? There's a town, if you could call it that, to the northeast of our city. It is filled with creatures that are polluting the groundwater with dangerous radiation. Oh. Well, how so? Those things are operating a damaged atomic power plant. You see, they are immune to radiation. They don't care that they are slowly killing us with their poisons. Yeah, what do you want me to do about it? Disable their plant. Permanently. So that they cannot cause any more damage. How does it release radiation? Those things are operating a damaged atomic power okay. plant. You see, they... Sure. Sure, we'll go to Gecko and take a look. This might save us 200 bucks. Totally worthwhile. Uh, so my guess is it's a ghoul city and uh, yeah they're gonna be real pissed if we shut off their power Ooh, give me my rock gut wait that's how easy it is to smuggle things in okay so I come here I drop Ten beers and ten boozes in the middle of the road. I talk, let, get in, and then come back, take it, and, and okay, sure. That sounds really easy. What's that a uh, person who wanted me to find their? She's in this tent, right? The part was again five karma. I should take this as a reward, but you didn't give me any. Oh, this. No. Well, that's fine. A good deed is its own reward. Your Nixon doll. What is this? A small doll with a big red nose. Interesting. Hello there, stranger. I'm Ed, local Brahmin dealer. Oh, my friend Vic says he bought a water flask from you. Where'd that flask come from? Grab Brahmin through the big circle of Broken Hills, New Reno, Redding, the Den, Modoc, and back here. Okay. Broken Hills, I don't think we know where that is. South. Oh, dang. Okay. Jeez. Briefcase to New Reno. Fires in the wrench. So we should be able to obtain tools pretty easily, but a wrench. Uh, I might have to try and remember where a wrench is if I've, if I've even seen one.
but okay. Well, I'm sad that the Fall City music's going to stop. Take a look at Gecko. These broken hills is quite a bit far away. Small settlement of Gecko. You see someone whose skin has been very badly burned. Hello. Be nice while you're in town. I'm always nice. What's up? Okay. A tall ghoul with long hair. Another tragic player. Oh, yes, I do play tragic. Let's play, man. What? Wait, do you, do you play it with Ante? Did I lose my cards? You're kidding me. What an asshole. And, um, do, do, do I still have my tragic cards? No. Sell drinks, trade for things, tell stories, and play tragic. Tragic the, the garnering. Okay. It's not tragic the gathering. It's tragic the garnering. It's not just a game. It's an obsession. Not a cologne, either. Some think that the way it changes a person's life is tragic. But they just don't understand. No, really, it's wonderful. You should play. Just once. The first box of cards is free. A little something from me to you. Yes. That's just the first part. Now that you're one of us, want to play a game? You're going to have to show me how. It's simple, really. Even someone dumb can understand it. First you build a play deck out of the cards that you have, and then you... Maybe I'll play that. What sort of stories do you tell? You see, there's this head, right? A head? Yeah, it's a head, but it's not attached to a body, you see. It's been severed. A severed head, I see. Just hold on a minute. This severed head, you see, it's in hell. <laughs> and it flies around there, you know, in hell. And it runs into all kinds of famous people there. Ho, ho, ho. Well, it's, it's doing stuff. You know, it's got things it wants to do, and maybe things it's forced to do, 
The point is, it's doing stuff, you know? There. Hell. Oh god. I just can't stand it. What? All about a severed head. Get it? It's funny. How can you think about a severed head? In hell of all places. And not laugh. What? Um... Sure. Well, I want to trade. Vox Movies. Black Dahlia. Rare Earths. Yes. Gamma Gulp Beard. Uh, here, you can have another rock gut. Gamma Gulp Beard. Here, five bucks. I go to the bar and I sell them the booze. Goodbye. What is this? Junk. Keep out. Reactor 5. Poseidon oil. Okay, the manager's office. I'd like to speak to your manager. Hey Lenny, have you ever heard of a Gek? Okay. Wait, what? You met of the Vault Dweller? At Necropolis? Ghouls can't run too much anymore, so I knew it was an outsider when I saw them. They ran by so close, I could have touched them. I wish I had joined the Vault Dweller. Huh. Hey, what do you mean? Hey, you fixed the water system. It's true. But I agree. That memory is revered amongst my people. Will you join me? Good. Sure. Healing skills, yes. Awesome. What sort of weapons to use? Okay. Oh, we need to get better armor for him. Let's see the doctor. Run away when your finger hurts. Ranged, of course. Attack the weakest. Ooh. So, how do we get to the doctor? 
How do we tell him to use his doctor skill on something? Can he heal that cow for us? Oh! Oh, that brings up our skill back. I want his skill points. Lenny, Harold's assistant. Oh, wait. Are you Harold? Damn! Hello there, smooth skin. The name's Harold. I help keep this town running. Hello, Harold. What do you do here? <laughs> Whatever it takes to keep this place together. Better job on it than me. You don't sound so good. <laughs> yep, but I'm doing great for being dead. <laughs> I never get tired of the looks when I tell that one. <laughs> well, sort of. Our atomic reactors are mind sensitive. The people I got running it mean well, but... <laughs> well, they are not the sharpest tools in the shed, if you know what I mean. What do you mean? <laughs> Need a little time on the whetstone yourself, huh? I mean, they are not too bright. Here's an example. The other day, I get a report. On it, it says the main coolant valve should be shut down. That would have caused a meltdown. That would make the Grand Canyon look like a pig waller. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that would be bad. <coughs> now, I got things fixed up in time, but <coughs> we came close to the end there. Whew. They need someone to watch out for them. Okay. <coughs> Who'd have thought I'd be making things right? Although, if we don't get a hydroelectric magnetosphere regulator pretty damn quick, there is going to be trouble. What is that? <coughs> <laughs> well, technically, it's a thingy. Without a functional hydroelectric magnetosphere regulator, we are leaking radioactive coolant into the groundwater. Now, that means anyone using that water is not going to need a nightlight to take a midnight piss. Also, we need more fuel because our power plant is not burning it very efficiently. <laughs> Where do you get that, a regulator? Well, I'm certain those ornery bastards in Vault City have one. Not that they'd share. Hell, even if we had one of those thingies, I'm not so certain Festus could install the dang That's... thing. <laughs> well, they'd only help us if they thought it was in their own best interest to do so. <laughs> not much chance of that happening. <laughs> they shoot ghouls on sight. Makes conversation a bit tricky. That would, wouldn't it? I could try to. We need a hydroelectric magnetosphere regulator, and it needs to be installed soon, or we have got some real problems. What happens if you don't get it? <laughs> if we don't get it, you can bet those boneheads from Vault City will shut down our power plant permanently. What happens if that happens? Take dirt naps. Vault City doesn't play nice. They'll just come up here and kill all of us if we don't get that part. Well, <laughs> at least I'll have a tree for a monument. We need a hydroelectric magnetosphere regulator, yeah, and it we'll needs to one. be installed soon, or we have got some real problems. We get our fuel from the Broken Hills. That's a mining community some way south. What you need, youngster? Got a tree growing from your head? Jealous? His name's Herbert. I talk to him when I get lonely. <laughs> Just kidding. His name's Bob. What you need, youngster?
Well, you might try talking a woos over in the harp. You can't miss it. It's just across the way. <coughs> Alrighty. That was helpful. Be there, smooth skin. Okay, we're gonna get a part from Vault City. Let's just take a quick look at this reactor. No, no, let's let's leave. Let's go back to Vault City. We'll have to leave our ghoul friend out outside. I think. Ooh. Hopefully it'll be fine if we just leave him like outside the front gates. And hopefully the guards at the front gates don't shoot him. Uh, courtyard. You. Wait here, friend. Do I still have that day pass? I do. It's probably not still good, but... Let's see. I don't have any rock gun on me anymore. Val, maybe you can help. I'm gonna find your tools first. Huh. Over here, do you have a magnetic whatchamacallit? No. Okay, let's just go talk to the first citizen. I don't think she'll be inclined to help them. But you never know. I don't really think this is just about the groundwater. I think they just want those yes. ghouls dead. What is it? Have you resolved the situation? All they need is a hydroelectric magnetosphere regulator. So you haven't taken care of the problem? You have the part here, right? What if we do? That is only a temporary solution. Please fix the problem, not their power plant. Am I making myself clear? Said you wanted me to fix it. I have had enough of your foolishness. You are no longer permitted inside Vault City. My guards will escort you to the front gate. Wow. Really? Really? Okay. A little bit of safe scumming. We reload. Hmm. What do we 
we do. Well, let's go back to Modoc and the Den. Let's find that wrench and the uh, pliers. Who are you guys? Just bandits? Or benditos? Sure. We'll try and take them. Ow. Please don't kill. Oh wait, what? What is our ghoul doctor using? Ow. 59 hit points damage. What? Uh. Okay, that guy's going to murder us all. Yeah, we're dead. There's no way we're not dead. Damn it. Sack. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, so let's see, what, what weapon did you have? What is this, a zip gun? Sure. Give him a healing powder. And a stem pack. Useful regulator. Sure. Alright. Try this again. Shouldn't be just cutting through here. Brains. Mmm, brains. What was everyone got like automatic weaponry now? Okay, okay. They're going to kill Sulik again, aren't they? Kill Lenny. That was a lot of damage. I think they each moved like twice, and I didn't even get a turn. Lenny's dead. Okay, maybe we don't just cut through the madness. Maybe this was a bad idea. Kill plenty of those bastards. <sighs> the Vault City. Go back to Modoc from Vault City. And maybe that's a safer route. Hello, traveler. Do this. I wonder if other towns are going to shoot Lenny on site. Press at market. No, no, we'd be we'd fetch a horrible press at market. You don't want us. Machine guns, I don't want to mess with them. Good little 
zip gun. Now we can probably stop here and heal. Man. Take it slow. Once again, my spirit touches you from the void. Chosen, our crops fail, our reserves are meager. Return to us with the gag. Your failure is our last light. Sorry, man, I don't have it yet. Right outside of town. Almost person. That is a lot of enemies. Okay. Sorry, homeless people. You're on your own. <laughs> I love the crazy arms running. Why are you guys killing homeless people? They probably don't even have anything to loot. I don't understand. Homeless person is killed. Very sad. Is there a homeless child there too? Wow. So, Lenny, can you fix this cow? Thanks, Lenny. The cow. No. Really did nothing for us. But I feel better. Save. We need to go to the den to talk to uh, someone there, anyways. Now, do you sell a tool or a wrench? Hey, you have a lot more stuff now, but it's still not what I need. To the den, we will talk to the guy, tell him to come back here. And we'll try and make our way to New Reno, maybe. I guess. Oh, geez, getting to the den from here is such a pain in the ass. Don't stop fighting and running. Hopefully I don't fight Koga again. Okay. 
Alright, so there's bandits. The Moonshiners attacked by high women. So the Moonshiners have always been nice to us. Maybe. Maybe we actually stay and help them. They have a new slot. I can spell. These are all moonshiners on the side. Five bad dudes, sure. Wait, what? Bootlegger was hit instead of highwaymen. It can be real hard to not use the uh, bootleggers and the highwaymen. Shoot, shoot, Lenny. Damn it. Let's try and do nothing. I'm gonna stab him next turn. Moonshiner. That's a bandit. Right? This guy's a bandit. Kabaka baka. There's a lot of these bootleggers getting killed. This will get us enough uh, money to buy Lenny some armor. We loot all these people's weapons. Wow, my spleen! Shiners are winning, so we're doing doing well. Bandits are still alive. Look at that guy as a bandit. Are you a moon shiner? Sure. I think that's the last one. Ah. Oh. Oh, my message with crazy Lenny. Wait, who are they shooting? Who's still an enemy? Uh, I can't tell. I was so pissed because I accidentally shot him. Crap. Please don't kill someone. We have to stop and rest. Kill 
killing homeless people again. friendly fire. Ow! Oops, Vic was hit instead of homeless person. doing a good job. Okay, next turn we're out of here. I'm sorry, I can't help you guys. I'm weak. We need to go, I don't know, farm some geckos or something. XP. Okay. Whew. So Sue looks all healed up. I think he's the only one who took a serious amount of damage. We do need to get plenty of millennium. Can't forget. I think we'll sell that assault rifle as well. Alright. Get out of here. Really? Already? No, I don't want to encounter highwaymen. Why would you even ask that? You know, all the way down there. I guess we'll try and get to New Reno. We'll go down to Redding again. They killed the Wanamingos, actually. Not a fan of the golden geckos there irradiating me, but we could use their pelts. Oh, nice. Okay, let's let's wipe out this plant life. They're plants. I guess some plants have hearts. Artichokes. Maybe that's what it means. Worried about the geckos. Just a lot of them. Well. Die, villainous plant. Plant scum. Hope them come to us. Okay, that's fine. Dream, you gecko.
Your skins. Oh, they're tough golden geckos. They're not regular golden geckos. Are they all tough? Golden gecko, golden gecko. Oh, well, these ones don't say tough. Okay, there's just one tough. You know what? We can do this. Howie. Hopefully I don't die of radiation poison. So, we'll go for the eyes. Well, that wasn't as effective as I had hoped. I did run. Wow, how far that guy went. Okay, we don't need to go for the eyes. How's that gecko going? He's just fleeing? Wearing some of its slimy skin off. Yeah, give me that skin for my skin collection. Uh, is there another here? Hey, buddy. I just want your friend's skin here. It's only a rabbit. It is. It is not a rabbit. Yeah, give me that. Okay. Let's go. Why go after me? Ow. Lenny. I do not appreciate being shot. There. Go sell these. Actually, can we rest now? We probably should. What does being radiated do to me? So where was this guy when he talked to? The oh, Carl. I don't remember where Carl was. He's like a drunk. That's all I remember. Carl. Carl. Is it Mom's? Maybe Mom's diner. Carl! Hey, Carl. Hey, you can go home. There's no more ghosts, my friend. Wait. The enemy is upon us.
The enemy's not upon us. What? Where are you attacking me, lady? Oh no. Now all of my friends are going to attack you. So look, guys, please don't kill that random addict. Is this because we have a ghoul with us? Look, no! I'm gonna punch that lady in the face. Oh my god. Um. Do we have like. Yeah, let's go back in. Uh, you, I'm sorry, you, uh, wait here. I'm sorry, friend. I don't want every random homeless person to attack me. Let's see if someone here has a wrench or, um, pliers. Oh, dude, need that. Right away. I'm gonna get Lenny a leather jacket. How much did I get for all these? How much is a leather jacket? Um, okay, we could get Lenny sweet jacket. Should we? Do it. Oh, just out of curiosity, what does. Whoa! Okay, so Star Trek Federation phaser sells for a lot. Uh, the guy in here. Traded with you a lot. Nope. Better play. Let's check the mechanic, dude. Hey. Is there a change for PD? Sure. Oh, I leveled. Um... I think we need to be even better at melee weapons. Maybe. Maybe science as well. Sneaking. Oh, there's just two main things. Uh, I'll save those points for now. Remember that we have them. What do you have? Molotov cocktails. Beer, a box of noodles. Interesting. Oh, I do have this regulator I picked up in Klamath. I thought I showed it to you already, though. Yeah, we definitely showed this to him already.
think I would have sold anything to anyone else here. What? What was that? The cow randomly exploded? What? Okay, we have to see if we can duplicate that. Oh, I want the cow explosion. Why is that just a thing that happens? Let's buy Lenny's jacket again. Four of these are your skins. I'd like a jacket. That looks good. You bad Jojo. Let's get out of here. have given Lenny his jacket. Trappers trying to catch rat scorpions. Sure, we'll help. Wait, they're trying to kill them or catch them? A dirty, unshaven man. Those trappers. Oh, uh, sure, you know what? We'll help. I am pretty much the most helpful person ever. Those scorpions are punks. Oh, okay, they want us to leave? Or are they just yelling at the scorpions? I don't think they need our help. Okay. Sure, I'll leave. Yeah, they've got this in the bag. Seemed none too friendly. A farmer? Sure. What's up, dudes? What do you have? Uh, you have nothing of value. Hey, Lenny. Here's some armor. 
Wait, did I not give you, um... Oh, I didn't. Maybe. Yours. There you go. There you go. We'll save when we get to claim it. Lenny, I'm gonna tell you to wait here again. I'm sorry. Never know though who's going to randomly attack you. We can't have any spare tools in here, do you? Uh, we already looted this place. Maybe we sold them to this barkeep. Had, we had a tool at one point. What did we do with it? How much money do you have? I think that's enough to buy a lizard skin. Reloaded, we haven't actually told Carl yet. Okay. Okay, I will do that. Well, I was really hoping to find those pliers here. Uh, but we could just go look at that car again now. We have Vic, maybe? Uh, where are you, Vic? Yeah, the Vic skill is repair, so maybe... If Vic here, we can get some more from it. Anything else we can loot over here? I don't know what we do with that key card. Yeah, let's not mess with the robot. It's this this some? Yeah, let's go get to that car. There, there isn't an easy way there, is there? We have to go into the uh, mole rat thing again. Guys, do we need to go down here and then up a different way? I definitely forget how to exactly get there. Is it this one? Thank you. 
Back, use. Yeah. Okay, Vic, help me look at this car. find some other card. Get up. Child followed us all the way in here. Gross. Well, we need some flyers and stuff. I just can't remember where any of those things are. Come on, Lanny. Oh, uh, let's save. We have to go talk to Carl again, because we didn't end the save. <sighs> we'll talk to Carl. We'll go to Redding. We'll fight one of Mingo's. And we'll, I guess, slowly make our way down to New Reno. Sud and you wait here, friend. Hey Carl. Wait. Get to ready. Um, some slaves and slavers fending off golden geckos. I wouldn't mind some more gecko skins, to be perfectly honest. Oh, I should have just let them all fight it out. Why did I attack it? I'm an idiot. Now I won't be able to loot as many dead slavers. Uh, 
that is that the only top going gecko or there's regular ones? I think so. Maybe we can just ignore them now. Let's just let them fight each other. What the heck? Slave was hit for 80 hit points and killed. Slave was hit for 41 hit points and killed. The heck? Even your own slaves. That's not good business. Slaves are fighting the slavers. Okay, let's, let's go help them. Not entirely sure what's going on, but. Fight someone. I don't have any. Zip gun killed a gecko? A critter at least? So who are you? A tree. Slaver. Well, slaver's gotta die. who I'm supposed to be attacking. Oh, wow, that almost... That did a lot of damage. I feel so empowered. Lol. See nothing out of the ordinary. He looks severely wounded. Is that the slaver, though? Is that Sulik? Does that zip gun use? Out of ammo for his deagle. Your your slaver. Let's let him come to me. I think that's where he's going. Howdy! Right in the spear range. How convenient. 
Goodbye. Okay, uh, hello. Damn it, Lenny, move. Ugh. How dare you punch me. Nice. It's one slaver and two slaves. Oh no, you can't run away. Wow, it's body blocker. eventually kill her. Come on, you guys. Stop whiffing. Just missing. Does no one have any ammo left? Have a weapon? This is such a pain in the ass. Fine, let's just let her run away. killer. Oh, that's perfect. We just have to... Nice. Yeah, skin. Dead slaves don't have anything. Sorry. Dead slaver up here. Why have you ever used your SMG? Is it busted? 
Here, let's let's trade. Okay, I mean, it looks what fun. You be needing? Here, you can have this back. Yeah, it's empty. Okay. okay, we're still trying to get to Reading. I'm probably going to, in, I don't know, 10 15 minutes maybe, get off and get some lunch. Golden geckos and wolves, no. Not after that one time that we encountered like 20 wolves and they just swarmed and immediately killed me. Right. Uh, so I'm sorry, Lenny, I'm going to ask you to wait here again. You'll have to get used to this. Not that I'm embarrassed of you or anything, but... I can't have random homeless people attacking you. You know, actually, I'm going to get off now. I'm going to get off. We'll fight the Wanamingos next time. That way I know uh, what to do when I load up and save. Oh! Hey! Uh, I'm uh, about to, I think, um, sign off for the day, but but thank you, o Ola. Hello. How are you? <laughs> that is an interesting username. String of uh, just random numbers. Halo. Interesting. <laughs> well, I'm going to leave you guys, go get some lunch, and uh, yeah, peace out. I'll play some more Subterracore, I think, on Tuesday. Later.